Uh, I knew a couple of teams was talking to my agent about that. I don't know, one of them was Regina. And uh, I was waiting for the trade. And yesterday, uh, after the practice, almost in the evening, I found out, found out that uh, I got traded to Regina. And I was really happy about that. You were leaving, you're leaving a really good team. What do you think specifically about coming here to a, a team that's maybe looking to get a little younger? You know, I'm looking to win every game and uh, to make a playoffs and go the far as we can. And uh, I, I was talking with the co coaching staff, and uh, we just I came here to bring the energy and help the team to win a Memorial Cup. How well, crazy has the off season been? I mean, you thought maybe a chance to go to the KHL. Did, going back to Calgary, now you're in Regina. I mean, not knowing where you're going to play, how, how tough is that? Oh, yeah, that was crazy because uh, in the end of the last season, I had a contract uh, with the KHL team, and I uh, was really excited to go to my hometown and play in the really good league, you know. And uh, then, like, a couple of days before the NHL draft, I found out that uh, the team can't be there because of the situation in Ukraine. And uh, I talked with my agent right away and decided that I'm coming back to Calgary, you know, and spend the season there. Uh, I came here, I got invited to Flames Camp. Uh, I made a main camp and I had a lot of experience, a lot of fun there. And when I came back to Hitman, I had a game, a game with the Hitman. But then I, I still knew that I'm going to be traded. And that's what happened right now. And I'm here. It was crazy, but now I, I know that I'm here in uh, Regina. And uh, it's kind of hope it will settle down a little bit for me. How early did you know that you were likely going to get traded? I mean, did you know full well coming back to Calgary that you wouldn't be there long? Yeah, because, uh, you know, Calgary, uh, they didn't know that I'm coming back. And they re released me from Western Hockey League. And uh, they drafted a new European guy, you know. And uh, when I came back, uh, uh, Every, almost everybody knew that I'm coming here, but uh, I knew that and I felt really good because Calgary gave me a really good two, last two years to be there. And uh, I played a, a lot against Regina. I know a couple of guys here and know the situation here and was really happy to be here right now. Is it hard to turn the page after you were thinking you were going to go pro, take the next step in your career, going to make get a paycheck finally, and then you're back in junior? Oh, you know, uh, uh, if when I when I signed KHL contract, uh, I I wouldn't have a lot of ice time there, you know, and uh, I'm still like pretty young player, 20 years old, you know, and. Uh, it's pretty good to have a lot of ice time, and Western Hockey League is the best junior league in the world. And uh, I will have a lot more my ice time that I would have in KHL. And you know, it's two sides. One side, uh, it's pretty good for me to play in Western Hockey League because I'll have a lot of ice time, and NHL team can look at me and uh, hope I, I'll stay here. In, in KHL, yeah, it's a good money there, but you know, I wouldn't have a lot of experience there. But I'm looking on future to play and. Just have a lot of ice time.